now welcome back to my youtube channel and i'm gonna do a better intro today than normally i am katie also known as the tradie wife also known as some sort of cult leader of the shit mums club uh working on a, a, a name for that um i'm the director of the shit mums i don't know general of the shit mums I don't know, but anyway, I got two hauls for you today, um, and I also want to ask if anyone's interested in like a full charity shop, what I've got for Christmas haul, so like all the bits that I've managed to pick up cheap, and where, how much I paid, and all that kind of stuff, from a charity shop for Christmas, I thought that'd be fun, I love watching other people do hauls, I guess, so if you're interested, let me know, um, this is my glossy box this month, this is a tin, Look, can you see? I've got a, I got a light now, look. I am doing my stand. I've never fucking charged it. I didn't think it worked. I was like, it's never worked. It works. It works. Um, but yeah, look at this. Cute, isn't it? Let's open it up. As usual, box with the little catalogue telling me blah, blah, blah. Apparently, this glossy box is worth £111 or something I've seen on Instagram. Um, so, that's everything that's in it today. We'll open it up, is it? Cutely wrapped as always, glossy box. I'm just chuffed with the tin. I'm gonna put my makeup in this. I like, I love it. I love it. It's really cute. And again, I'm ripping all the packaging. That's all the stuff. So first off, what have I picked out? Not what was this then? RRP. So I like this. You've said like it's like 111 pounds worth of stuff, right? Glossy box. Just gonna have a rant, your mate. RRP £75 for what? A packet. A, pa a fucking packet. I don't know what it is. Perfume. Store perfume in a cool, dark, dry place to ensure it lasts. I'm going to bin that glossy box. I'm not going to lie. It's a piece of tact. I'm going to open it now, smell it, tell you what it smells like. And then I'm going to end up finding it somewhere on my dressing table after I've done this video. And I'm going to be like, oh, it's shit. Do you know what I mean? So that's it anyway. Oh, and i got to do that thing now when I flip the camera around and show you. Oh, it's not happening. It's not happening, lads. It's not going to be a great YouTube video today. Oh, it smells like an old woman. Yeah, do you know what? I went to like 20 charity shops today. It smells better than this. No, nah, not for me. It smells like a charity shop. Not charity shop. Charity shop smells like sir. Old woman. If you want to smell like an old woman, 74 quid, you can smell like a granny. Right, oh, there's another packet. Oh, RRP £1.95. Okay, that's more realistic for a bloody thing. Beauty Pro. Is that the people that do the hair stuff on our Beauty Works? They're just little masks around your eyes. Get rid of the bags. Nothing's getting rid of these bags, right? I've got two kids. I barely fucking sleep because my anxiety is through the roof. And, I, you know, the amount of concealer I put on. No, you're not getting rid of these bags. These are bags for life. And then, I think the tin has contributed to most of this of £100. Glow Priming Moisturiser. Kombucha Glow Moisturiser. I see this kombucha thing a lot because that woman on TikTok, that Erin, was it? I don't know, life with her baby, her baby's cost something like leaf, I don't know. Um, and she's always making her own kombucha and it's like a bit of mould in a pot or something. I don't know, I haven't really looked into it. So, you know, if you want a mould in a pot... Um, primer priming moisturizer can I put this on then before my makeup let's have a whiff is it it's, it's peach colored I, I just can smell that fucking old woman smell it's like oh it's nice and light it's a light moisturizer put on my hands yeah it smells like the old woman because that fucking thing has reeked everything so far, I'm not that impressed with this box. What's this? A keratin hair mask. I do need to put some stuff on my hair. My ends are getting dry. That smells nice. It smells like... Oh, I want to say coconut, but it's probably not, is it? This apparently is a fiver. How the fuck is that little old woman smelling packet? 74 quid. And this is a fiver. All right, ripped off your mid. The healthy hair, the strong... Don't tell me what the smell is. Unruly hair is to become sleek, soft and rich. I just want something to like make my dead ends look better so I don't have to go to the hairdressers because I ain't got time to go to the hairdressers. Like. It smells nice so I look forward to using this. I'll put this on my hair today because I'm going to have a bath. 
And then we've got our Spectrum brush. I like Spectrum. I don't know if you've used them before. I have had lots of Spectrum brushes in my glossy boxes in the past when I used to get them. And they are good brushes. Um, you know, everyone loves a brush tonight for your makeup. Ah, uh, I think it's a highlighting brush. It's quite big. You know, soft pink, cute, like it, very cute. And then we've got this, which is RRP 25 quid. Oh, that was 8 99 the other one. Oh, Moonlight Glow Face Palette. Oh, I know everything's backwards because I film in the front-facing camera, right? Sorry. Oh, blush, lush. Blush, lush. Blush, blush. Oh, I like that. Oh, I like that. And it's got a darker kind of blush as well. Oh, let's try that on my hand. This is the pink. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. That is like Coco the Clown kind of pink. Woohoo! Imagine putting that on your face. This one is probably, this is the Luna blush. That's more my kind of blush colour. I've wanted like an orangey coloured blush for a while. And then I, the, the bloody Brunel fingers here. That's a good contouring colour. And then I can't, I don't think you can fuck up a highlight. I don't know, maybe. They're nice. I think they're quite creamy. I don't know how much how well they blend though on my face. I could do like two pink bits for you. Probably look like a right my bit. But yeah, that's a cute palette. I like the moon and all that. It goes in the box. Uh, what would I rate this glossy box out of ten? I feel like last week's one was better, wasn't it? I haven't had time to try on that um stuff on my eyelashes really either. I, I to be honest, I've been trying to make more time for myself in the night, but I haven't. Oh, and we did get a Free piece of chocolate. What is up with them chucking chocolate in you? Well, I don't know what to say about that, really. I think that, that fucking make, that perfume thing's ruined it for me, see? I'm not going to lie. It stinks. It's reeking this house right now. But the tin was cute. And the, the hair stuff was all right. I, I give it a, I say I was like a four out of ten for that glossy box. No, I'll give it a five because the tin was nice, but... For what they were saying on Instagram, being like, oh, RRP, 111 quid for all this shit, when the one thing is 74 quid, and it's a fucking packet. So, yeah. Anyway, she my cherries haul. I don't know if you've ever shopped with cherries, but I discovered them recently when they reached out to me, and then they, they gift me cherries stuff, they, basically. And I'm like, okay, give me, I, I'm happy to be gifted that, and I'll just shout and rave about it, because... The delivery is quite quick, I will say. I think I ordered like th two days ago, maybe. I had like next day delivery on it. Um, and it's really good if you don't have a and m or home bargains near you or you want something for and m and home bargains but you can't be asked to fucking walk there eh, or drive there, whatever. It's basically like an online B&M. So, massive box of shit. I will be putting this on my TikTok as well, but my little YouTube fam, you can have first look. So I'm not going to edit this one, I don't think. I'm just going to put it up as it is. Okay, why not? Oh, it's so strong these days. I'm going to cut my hand off now. Massive box. The cat loves it when I get these boxes as well. He bloody sits in them. Cat's my biggest fan of the box. I just looked at it then and I thought, oh my God, I haven't even been fucking recording, but I have. All right. I'm not very good at this, guys. TikTok's easy. Oh, if you don't follow me on TikTok, follow me. But you probably do for you because no one else is watching my YouTube. Are they? Oh, right. What will I rate the box? Bloody sturdy. If you move it out, it's a good box to have. Ah, oh, right. So, Adam's not going to watch my... Um, YouTube because I, I don't think he ever does because he just thinks he's about makeup and shit. Um, so I got him an old spice gift set. I just needed some shit to get him for Christmas. So yeah, deep sea minerals. I'm not gonna open it obviously it's for Christmas. <gasps> I got a little selection bag for Christmas. Oh Adam's fave Toblerone. So I got him one of those. Um, oh, I got some fairy because, you know, I'm still going through my eco 
pot, pot of stuff. I don't know if you know, but it's been lasting me bloody ages. Um, but I, I did buy some fairy pods for the days I can't be asked to put powder in. I just thought I'm going to be lazy over Christmas. Who oh, isn't? Um, I got some sweeties for the stockings. Ah, oh, I got this I wanted to try. Cheeks, lip and skin. Wonder balm. Um, but it was peach tinted. Because I want to try and not wear foundation as much. Like, I haven't got much foundation. I've got really light coverage on today. Um, but I want to just let my skin breathe a bit more. So I thought I'd try this. It's, um, it's for che cheeks, lips and skin. So I thought, oh, if it's anything like... Do you remember if you've ever used... I think it was called This Works. I had a sample of it before in my glossy box. And I was gutted that, like... I didn't buy the full one, but it's really expensive. But it's like a tinted moisturiser. And if you put it on your legs, it kind of gives you the appearance you're wearing them skin coloured tights. So like any blemishes you had on your legs, you know, if you were going out and you felt a bit like that. And I was hoping that would have the same effect, but on my face. Yeah. We don't know. We don't know. Katie could be talking shit. I probably am talking shit. More sweets. More sweets. Oh, then this thing. Um, I thought, I'll give this a go. Vitamin C serum. So I thought, oh, I'll chuck that on my face. Helps brighten and illuminate skin. I was like, I'll give that a go. Uh, I got this one for Rue in her stocking. Practical. A cotton clouds white cashmere shower gel. Because she stinks. She's only two lover, but she shits a lot and it does reek. Oh, I got a teeth whitening pen. I bought one of them ages ago and I thought, oh, I'll give it another go. I honestly don't know what to buy. Oh, I bought the Santa Footprints. For the talcum powder, I guess a little bit old this year, so I thought, oh, I'll do this to make him think Santa's been. Oh, more stuff for the Christmas Eve box. Mini gin gingerbread men. I got some pink smarties. Got some fairy, mate. I I tried the, the eco fairy. If you if you know if you knew you, yeah. me and the eco bloody washing up liquid didn't get on right you can't beat fairy right i don't know how they make it or what it is but you can't it doesn't nothing washes dishes like fucking fairy right and this one is in a different language don't know i don't speak this it looks european um but it's mint mint smelling one it was like a christmas one so i thought oh i'll try that mint I hope it doesn't make the dishes taste of mint. And then some snow, mini snowballs, because I love these. So these are going in my stocking, because I don't think anyone else makes my stocking. I do believe I make my own. Um, and then I got... Oh, we were talking about these the other day, and I I, I love them. I've been using them on a kid's hair and my hair, um, along with my other my shampoo bar, my coconut bar. I'm nearly out of that now, anyway. But... I love the smell of this banana because I have a shit mum's club candle that smells exactly like it and I'm addicted to that smell and now I found this that smells exactly like it and, and that's all I want to wash my hair in now. I flipping love it and the kids, I love it when they smell like banana so they're only a quid so I got, I'm guessing bloody my children when they're in the bath, I think they think they're playing like Harry Potter or something he emptied half of the shampoo in the, into the bath. So whoever has shampoo that runs out before conditioner, this month I did because he emptied the entire thing into the bath. And I kept, it smelled amazing. Like, I couldn't fault him. So I bought two conditioners and a shampoo because I love them. They just smell amazing. And then I got myself a Santa costume, which I'm going to put on now. I am. I'm going to go downstairs and be like, ho, 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 and wind Adam and get her. But yeah. That was a quite a good cherry haul, I think. Um, yeah. Well, thanks for watching this video. Um, have a good Christmas. I don't know if I'll see you on YouTube now. But I will. If you want a Christmas charity haul, what I've got, I've got bags. i got to pull them all out, see? And everything that I managed to get and how much I paid and all that to inspire you to get your ass down the charity shop. Start being eco and save your fucking money. I'm just saying I'll do that for you. Let me know. 
um yeah but if not if i don't see you before christmas i hope you have a lovely christmas i hope you spend lots of time with your family let's all have a fucking party because boris did so um um yeah i can't wait i'm gonna get up to you steam in i'll be saving this bottle of rum that we had for our wedding off my cousin he's into rums he is sam is thank you sam ledge um i'm into rum and he's into rum but he collects posh rum and he gave us a posh rum for a wedding and i was like let's save this for a special occasion so that's under the cupboard in the sink by the sink yeah but that, that's it that's all my whole plan is to uh, get as pissed as i can and i've roped adam into doing the dinner because i was like no nah, i did the dinner last year i was like i'll peel a spud the night before and all that but dinner's on you i'll sit drink be merry with the children. Yep, I'm resigning off Christmas. Anyway, I'm babbling on, talking shit as always. Like and subscribe to me if you like me. If you don't, I don't blame you. Um, and I'll see you next time. Oh, I sounded so passionate. See you next time. Peace out.